Hey, it's Jay from Encodian. So we're going to look at another Encodian utility action today. Uh, the one we're going to focus on is the utility compare text action. And we're going to go through a really simple scenario, as we have with most of the utility actions, about how, how to use this action within your flow. So I've got a manually triggered flow. I'm going to add two inputs, two text inputs. We'll just call it text1. And we'll add another input of text2. And what we'll now do is we'll just go and get the uh, Encodian compare tax action. So we'll go down to standard connectors, find Encodian. We'll click see more and see more again. Again, I know that I'm going to need to go to the bottom because all of the utility actions are prefixed with the utility hyphen. And we're looking for compare text. So bear with me a moment. Here we go. Right. So the compare text action will accept two different um, two different values and it will return a boolean value where true is that they're the same, false being that they're different. There is um, an added feature coming in the next few weeks uh, where you can control whether to ignore case sensitivity or not. At the moment um, it is case sensitive as you would expect so um, if for example test and test would be deemed to be different because they're case sensitive. But that a feature's coming where you can turn that case sensitivity off should you need to. Right, so uh, I'm just going to pass in those first two values that are coming from the user. So we've got text one and then we've got text two. And I'm next going to add a control, a condition control to, the, to say are they the same or not? So the utility actions return their values in what's called the result. Uh, this example, it's a Boolean. So we're going to say the result property is equal to, apologies, to true. Then we'll just do send, oh, sorry. Just go to notifications. And we'll just send the notifications. We'll do mobile. Uh, the same. And then we'll just copy this into the clipboard. Bear with me a moment. I'll just come across here. We'll pop this one in here. Uh, different. So now that's our flow. So we've got two two text values coming in. We're comparing them. We're getting the results to find out whether they're the same or not. And then we're going to do something based on uh, on that result. So I'll click to manually test the flow. And we'll do the very old hello world. And we can pop those in there and run the flow. And that will run through nice and quick. And we can see that we're getting an input to say that those values are the same. Well, they should be the same, so I copy and pasted them. So uh, hopefully that gives a quick demo about how you can use this within your, within your flows as ever. Um, if you have any questions or need any guidance, you can email us at support at encoding.com or visit us at support.encoding.com.